Now, another thing we look at in CVs are skills, which is something people can add to their CVs to show employers what programs or software they're familiar with. And I'm all for having a list of software in there. It kind of shows me that this person has had experience in using certain industry-specific software. Now, speaking of listing skills, one thing that might be specialized for medical illustrators or animators are industry-specific skills. So I've seen some of my colleagues and friends list anatomy knowledge, like surgical illustration or molecular illustration or like like they have laboratory experience as part of their list of skills. This is something that might be useful because sometimes you might need a team member or a freelancer that has a specialty in a medical area like molecular visualization. Thinking off the top of your head, what other specific skills might be applicable for our industry? Well, for digital illustration or design, there's usually the whole Adobe Creative Cloud suite. So Photoshop, Illustrator, InDesign, mm. or animation. People could list things like After Effects, 3D programs, like Maya, Cinema 4D, 3DS Max, Houdini. For specific skills for working, data could include knowledge of segmentation software like 3D Slicer, Invisalius, Amira, BG Studio Max, Protein Data Bank, Chimera, Pymol, the list just goes on and only add software and knowledge based on the skills that you know you have or have worked on before. Don't list anything that you are not comfortable to be pulled up in an interview because you might get a difficult question. And if you genuinely are not an expert or intermediate at this area, then it could potentially be very awkward. <laughs> yeah, and, and you're totally right. People do check. If a person lists something like Unity in their CV, I'm going to go and like cross-reference this and try and find evidence of a Unity project and their portfolio not to like cash them out i'm just really interested to see that i'm really excited to see that because i don't know it so i want yeah. a person that does know it more often than not we get applicants that have listed a whole bunch of skills and software and the only thing that we see in their portfolios are, are pencil sketches or photoshop illustrations and i'm real sad about that mm. 